I'm going to uh, prove the centroid theorem. Uh, this states that the three medians of a triangle meet in a point, and each median is trisected by this point. So first I'm going to um, draw my triangle, uh, use the line segment tool here. Uh, we'll draw a scalene triangle that's not much of anything. Now that looks but um, I, suspiciously isosceles, so we'll uh, change it a touch. Um, and we're going to be dealing with distances, so I'd like to actually constrain the length. So I'm going to make this A, I'm going to make this B, and I'm going to make this C. Now, to do a median, I, I'd like to, I can use this tool to get the midpoint and then I can connect the midpoint up to the opposite um, a vertex of the triangle. However, GX Web's got this convenient tool that lets me select not just the segment, but also the point, and then the midpoint construction, and that will create the uh, median directly. I'd now like to intersect these two medians, so select those, those two lines, and then um, we have here the intersection uh, tool. And so we have this point F is now the intersection of these two medians. What we'd like first to show is that F also lies on the third median. So let me create the third median. And now it certainly looks as if it lies on it. We can, uh, we can drag our, uh, we can move our, uh, triangle around either by changing A, B, and C up here in the numeric panel, or if we unlock the three um, uh, quantities, we can uh, we can drag around. And certainly, F looks as if it lies on there. But to prove it, we need to go into our symbolic panel uh, down at the bottom and ask for the distance between F and the line CG. This gives me the perpendicular distance between F and the line C, the extended line CG. Uh, and the answer is zero. That says that F lies on CG. Uh, secondly, we need to show that F is two thirds of the way along A to D. So first I can ask for the distance between A and D and we get that in terms of the lengths of the sides of the triangle. And now we can ask for a distance between A and F. And if we uh, do a little bit of algebra on that, we can convince ourselves that that is actually two thirds of the distance from A to D, or we can have uh, GX Web do the algebra. If we're uh, sufficiently lazy, I prefer typing to thinking, I guess, is what it comes down to. There we have it. That's two thirds. So I've, I've proved the centroid theorem.